Hey everybody, thanks for coming. Today's a nice day, so I thought I would film a little bit outside for my vlog a few days ahead, because I'm not quite what it's sure it's going to do closer to the time. So, we've had a few activities lately, but not too much, because September was kind of quiet. On the 9th, I went down to the river with my daughter and the dog. We walked along the dike early in the morning before it got too hot. Our friends had a beer fest on the 16th. That 30 liter keg is what our son brewed for his contribution and the two cans sitting beside it were what hubby and I brought. These are all of the beers that other people brought. There was various kinds. We all got to taste. The results were close, but our son's beer won by two points. Coming up on the weekend, we are not going camping, but my daughter and her friends are because it's her birthday on the 24th. And on the 27th, my husband and I are taking my mom and dad into Vancouver down to the cruise port so they can get on their cruise. They're going with friends down the coast and back. Our daughter will be using her tent trailer again at Thurston Meadows. My mom and dad will be sailing on the Sapphire Princess, round trip Vancouver. I have been able to work on projects a bit lately. In my last video for this, I showed you that gnome panel quilt, and I was able to get the binding already and sewn together. I just have to do the ironing and folding it in half. It's currently at the long armors, so when it comes back, I'll get that done and finish it up. I also worked a little bit on the rainbow string quilt, but I will be doing the update for that video by the end of the month, around uh, the 29th, 30th, something like that. I have completely finished with the green quilting. I went all the way around, and everything matches up now. So, here where I started with some quilting with the gray, I have my blue lines drawn. So I'm going to finish this gray area, and then I'm going to work myself that way, quilting with black. There'll be lots to do in the corner, so that'll take me a while. A little bit of gray there, and I'll just keep going all the way around. I'm making crumb blocks right now. I'm doing them at 12 and a half inches, because I happen to have a 12 and a half inch ruler, so it makes it a little easier. I have to make 15 of them. So far, I have one row of five blocks. I just put it aside until I can add to the other ones. Um, I'm going to make this for a, like a pad for my daughter's new bunny area for when she moves in, like a mat for underneath them. I'll show you guys once we get it in there and in situ it might uh, explain it a little better. 